everyone! So today I wanted to share a bonus Dollar Tree haul and shop with me video with you all. I planned so many fall DIY videos for the next few weeks that I didn't leave any space in my normal schedule to share the new items from Dollar Tree. So I decided that I would do that today and show you all of the newer items that I have seen in the stores recently. This video will have some great new wall art signs that I found at Dollar Tree. It will also show some new Christmas items that I didn't share in my sneak peek video a few weeks ago. It will also show the new crafting section that they are putting into Dollar Tree. The bigger store in my area has already put out this new aisle. It has so many awesome new finds in it and I can't wait to show you everything that they have in that new aisle. I hope your stores will get it or at least one store near you will get it so that you can also see and benefit from all of these great items. So I am going to share with you the items that I hauled from Dollar Tree. I am just going to show them to you super quick. I'm not even going to hold them up here. I'm going to show them to you just in my hands and show you from that angle. I'm going to go through them really quick and then I'm going to show you the shop with me portion as well and you can see everything else that's still in the stores that I did not purchase. I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you do, please hit that like button, please comment and subscribe and we'll go ahead and get started. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started with showing you everything. Like I said, I need to make this fast. I do have another video that I'm working on. Welcome to my back deck and all the sounds that come along with being in my backyard. All right, so I'm gonna start off with some fall themed items that I picked up. This sign, thankful, grateful, and truly blessed. It has this little hanger at the top of it. I also picked up this mug, pumpkin spice, and everything nice. They had a few different ones of these. They all had different sayings on them. Then I picked up some of these DIY wood stickers. I think I got some of these before, but I wanted some extras. I also, this is a repeat purchase, burlap leaves. This is a five pack. I love these with this wire on them. And then I picked up some of these towels. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you all of those. First is Hello Fall, and it has this polka dot background on it. And then this one is Pies the Limit, and it has these little pumpkin pies. And then this next one has a turkey on it, and it says Eat Ham. Let me know down in the comments whether you eat ham or turkey for Thanksgiving. I am a turkey person. And then I have this pumpkin pie towel, and it has the recipe to pumpkin pie on it. And then I picked up a couple napkins, so they both are a similar design. Just one is the larger ones and then the long thin ones. So they're an 18 count and 14 count. Next, I'm gonna show you some home decor and home items. So first off, I got this towel, Be the Bee, Make the Honey, and it has these cute little bees on the back, which look a little bit more like wasp to me, but I thought it was cute and I thought it would go along really well with some Target towels that had a bee theme to them. And then I got this one lone candlestick. I think these do come in some different colors, but this is the only one I found in my store. So it's kind of a ceramic, and I think this one may actually have a crack on it, but I was gonna spray paint it and hopefully cover that up. Then I got these little drawers with this cute little llama and cactus on it. These are gonna be used for organizing small craft supplies. And then I picked up some of these gold baskets. If you have not seen these yet, these are amazing. I got two of these round ones. I actually have a project in mind for those. And then I got, I think, eight of the rectangle ones. So let me just take out one so you can see just one single rectangle one. But these are amazing. I really love them. We are putting up some shelves in our office and I really just wanted a bunch of matching shelves, uh, baskets to organize the items on those shelves. And so I got a whole stack of these. And then next I picked up this little makeup bag, Live Happily. I just really loved the gold with the greenery on there. And I just thought it was a nice little makeup bag to carry some things in my purse. 
And then I got this decor sign and an ant to go along with it. Go away, little guy. And I just love this llama, and it has this kind of metallic to it as well. They did have some different decor signs out, and I really loved that one. And then this is another new decor sign. It says, Welcome to our beautiful chaos. I have put this on my letter board before, and I just love this little saying. It really goes well with my home. And so it has this little hanger on the back here, or it's wide enough that you can just set it right up. Next, I'm going to share some Christmas items. So first off, I picked up two of these Christmas trees. They have those out every single year. A new item this year is this little red truck ribbon, and this has nine feet on it. I picked up two of them. I'm sure I will find plenty of projects to use this on this year. And then a few decor signs. This is a new one, Have a Jolly Christmas, and it's made to look like the ball jar with the twine at the top. You could also do your own design on the back of that. And then two more new decor signs. This one says Farm Fresh Christmas Trees, Pine, Spruce, Fir. And then this one says Merry Christmas. And they have the little hooks on the back or they can also sit right up. Then I have some Christmas crafting supplies. So these are all five packs. I got two of these snowflake ones and then one of this little Christmas tree and these do come with this twine in there as well so that you can string them up and hang them on the tree or you can decide to use them for a craft as well. I also got this package of DIY stickers. This has the snowflakes, the star, and the tree and the star has glitter on it. And then lastly, I'm super excited about these pieces. These are new at Dollar Tree this year. This one says Merry and Bright and it is made of wood. It's very thin. I got two of the Merry and Bright one and then they also had Let It Snow and you can see it has a snowflake there and then they also had Peace on Earth. I feel like they may have had another one as well. I'm not positive that I videoed it but I think I did and then lastly this awesome awesome truck. I am so excited about this and the DIYs that I can do with this. I picked up three of these. If you see these in your store, pick them up right away. I went back to look at the same store just a few days later and they were already sold out of these. So I know they're not out in every store just yet. I only found them in one store so far, but these are going to be great for DIYs this year and I am super excited about it. Lastly, I want to share some crafting supplies. These first ones here were in the floral section. So I got this two pack of these mini wreath forms. And then my stores finally got in these pearls. I saw some other crafters using these, but I never found them in my stores until now. So this is a hundred count of these smaller ones and then an 80 count of these that are a little bit bigger. And then there's the next size that's bigger as well that I didn't purchase. And then the rest of these craft items are from the new section. So first off, I got these large glue sticks. They're extra long, and then these are the ones that are a little bit wider. And this comes in a five pack. I also got these pop dot adhesives. This has two sheets, 528 pieces, and you can see there, they are the small foam dots that kind of raise up items when you use them. I also got these foam sheets. This has 32 pieces. I got this for my kids for crafts. And then I got some markers. These are all put out by Dollar Tree. So first off, I got this white one. It says metallic marker. I'm not exactly sure how well it would work. I'm hoping that it will work well for some crafts. And then I got these two chalk writer ones, a gold one and then a silver one. And I'm going to try these out and see how they work. They had several different chalkboard tags. So these first ones here are actually wooden. This has this unique shape. They had another shape as well. I got three of those. And then these ones here are a kind of a hard cardstock. They're also chalkboard tags. They have this shape here. I'm not completely sure that you can see it with the dark dark background but it looks like a gift tag and then they have this round one as well and I got a couple of these these have these little strings on them to use them 
I also got this four pack of mini glass containers. I was surprised to find these glass ones. I'm hoping that they'll make some bigger ones as well eventually. They had an assortment of wooden items. So they usually have these super mini wooden clothespins. These ones are just slightly bigger, but not quite what you use on your clothesline. This is a 24 piece. And then they had these wooden craft cubes. They also had some other wooden plaques and stuff that I meant to purchase and then forgot about them, but you will see those in the shop with me portion. I also got this wooden word cut out. This one says hello. They also had some other ones as well. I picked up this natural jute cord. This is 2.8 ounces. I think this is a pretty good deal for this amount of jute cord. I got one of these wooden trays. They had some with, I think, a star cut out on the end as well. Hopefully, they'll make some that are a little bit bigger at some point. I also got these adhesive cork sheets. This is 11 and 3 quarters inches by 7 and 3 quarters inches. So they're pretty thin, so you can't really use them for a cork board, I don't think, unless you want to replace the cork on an already existing cork board. But I think they, they would be great for crafts. And then lastly, I have some stencils and stickers to show you. They had several different alphabet stickers. So this is the first one that I got. I liked this font. And then these are rub on transfer stickers. They're not necessarily stickers. They have instructions on the back of how to use them, but I got these gold ones. And then I got this one here, these cactus designs as well. This has, it doesn't say how many, so I'm not really sure how many are on there, but it's a good amount, I think, and I like the colors and the designs. And then this one here has just different words. I thought this would be great for some smaller projects to rub those on, but it just, it has a lot on there for paying a dollar for it. And then lastly, I got three of these rub-on transfers. These are eucalyptus and different types of leaves. I think this one may actually be considered eucalyptus as well, but I just love the designs on these. I thought they would be great to embellish some different crafts and projects and things like that. That was a lot to show you. Now we're going to go ahead and get into the shop with me portion.